2006 SeaDoo GTI 130s. Had this issue with the, the air code P1656, which when I looked it up said this shorted to ground. And when I put the, uh, the key on, supposed to do like short beeps. That's a little bit like that. It was just giving a really, really loud beep. And then the P1656 came up in the display and uh, uh, no start issue. So I was, uh, I was searching around all the forums, reading a lot online. The what all everything came down to was this here. Everybody said it was the desk post. It was the culprit. So since I have two of these, one of them was running perfectly, the other one was having this fault code. I moved the actual desk port of the wiring everything over to test it. But uh, the fault did not move. You would uh, expect the fault to if this desk port, it's faulty to move over to this one. Well, that didn't happen. Sounds like, hmm, well, now what? So it's not the wiring, it's not the desk post. The more investigation now pointed towards the ECU, or MPEM as the CEDU calls it. This puppy down here is almost a thousand dollars. So, I was having uh, big problems with doing a thousand dollar computer on a jet ski that's getting pretty up there in age. So luckily this, this 2006 is just like a year or two before they started marrying the cluster to the ECU. So, now I decided to move the computer over to see. That will work. So when I when I move the ECU over here now to that one, you're gonna have to use this guy's key because there's a chip in here that's married to the computer. And I move everything over and use this key, and the fault follows. So I'm like. Darn, is it actually going to be a computer that's going to be the issue this time? But, and this guy is running perfectly with that key, and, and that's computer. So, the only thing that changed at this point is that the fault seemed to become intermittent, meaning that it didn't do it all the time. It just did it once in a while. So now I had... Uh, was starting to suspect because I was putting the key on in like and then I tried to put the key on in like angles like something like this and the fault was intermittent at this point so I'm like hmm could it possibly be the key so I figured uh, before I try uh, drop a grand on a new computer to this I found a guy on, on, on Facebook Marketplace, I believe, that, that sold me this and these keys. He made the... I had to make two new keys to the, the suspected bad one. And wouldn't you know it? I almost... I was the key, I was the actual key that was bad. The chip in here. Shorting the entire system. I almost dropped a thousand dollars in a new ECU. That wouldn't even fixed anything <laughs> that's, the, that's the best part wouldn't even done anything so guys don't overlook the obvious try the key first if you got that that's issues